of all the grand stadia in world football, none more impressive than this. A very warm welcome to all of you from the San Siro in Milan. The teams then, AC Milan against Juventus. I'm Peter Drury and it's a pleasure to be alongside Jim Beglin. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. If you're just joining us, we are already on the way. So this is round two between these two sides who have already met once this season. You've big chance! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper... And the header! Goal! Juventus! Could that be the start of something, Bit? Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. And he heaves it forward. Just brushed off the ball there. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. A real chance to break. And Rooney! And that really should have hit the net. Juventus are looking quite mean on the counter. And, and Dybala! He's got away with one there. Well, the work rate. Dybala! Sterling finds himself. Owen! It's in! And they are disappearing out of sight. Juventus take a two-goal lead and things should... And the first 45 minutes are up. How's the first half compared with your expectation? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position. So why dither from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? Juventus sitting pretty here at half-time. 2-0 up. The second half gets on the way. Oh, good interception. Garay tries to dink it in. Shapes the shoot. Saved only by poor finishing. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that look... Is it in? In for the follow-up! And he's poked it home! And surely that settles it. Rooney! And he should have made it for... Another example of how comfortable this... Up for the header! Keeper's got his work done. Boots it to safety. Now the pass. Fake. He's gone for it! And in it goes! Milan have chosen to bring on the last of their substitutes. So, just a consolation, or is there a way back from here? It's Iguain! And more, and more, and... More. Juventus make their final change. Yeah, their position is a, a dominant one now, Peter. So introducing one of the youngsters for some added experience is bang on. Juventus grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. Not yet. Looks to clip it forward. Iguain goes wandering offside. Added time is up. And there goes the whistle. So the central characters congregate, players, staff, coaches, all relishing the limelight. They are champions.
Soaking up the pre-match atmosphere here as we wait for things to get started. Won't be long now before we get through the formalities. A warm welcome one and all. The teams then, Juventus against Lazio. I'm your commentator Peter Drury and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beck. Hello Peter and hello to everyone watching. For me it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. Off we go then. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? It's Casillas for me, because if he gets a little busy in this game, he has the talent and... That goes for goal! There it is! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot-on-sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from where I'm sitting. He's put himself now in position to compete for the top scorer's title. Juventus have an early lead. Good start. Thorolo. Immobile. Juventus were imperious when the two sides last met. And the fans are asking for more of the same. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. Forward it goes. Passes it through. And he's cut it out. Looks like a good ball through. Dybala. Whipped in. Well read, he sorted that out. Now the ball's come loose and the chase is on. And it's Dybala. And the shot! Really well taken goal. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. Juventus take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable. Massive leap! Fantastic from Immobile! This is... Owen! Oh, taken with style! And there's the goal they've been looking for. Juventus go two up and into a position of real strength. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here because... For me, it's great leap! Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Well, I would think this one is possibly over as a contest. They know they've already reached cruise control, and it's a case of the right game management to take it from here. Well, that has been a goal-blessed half. It is 3-1. And we're underway again. No changes at half-time that we're aware of. Hurls himself at it! He will be livid with himself. Juventus just served up a reminder of how good they can be on the break. Their method is clear. Plays it out to the wing. Tries to get it forward quickly. Now the counter. Immobile pushes it out wide. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up there... Can he put it away? Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. The keeper really dug out his defence then. And, and the shot! More and more and more and more! They are running riot! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Juventus grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. De Frey does well to read it and intercepts. And the ball is out of play. Played out to the wing. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. 
Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Juventus certainly ran a perfect race from start to finish. 